Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So this is the wig that we are going to be working with today. This is World New Hair's 99J Burgundy wig. And I'm very excited to work with this wig today. I love working with color, so we're gonna install it. And yeah, my makeup done already. We're gonna install it, spray my face. And then, yeah, if you have any questions, let me know. I did not do the ball cap method today, did not feel like it. So it's really just a regular wig cap underneath. The best advice for people who do not really wanna do the ball cap method is just to push the, the, the wig cap back to where your real hair is showing, so yeah. The spray that I'm using today is the Wonder Lace Bond Spray, and this is how it looks. And this is, they usually have it in the red one, but I like the black one because it has a very, very strong hold. And um, I like it, I like it, I low-key like it more than the Got To Be because the Got To Be can sometimes leave white residue, but I, I'm not gonna hold y'all. A lot of people hate Got To Be, but I love Got To Be, like I can't even cap. But this one is, is better so if you are someone who really hates the got to be spray go ahead and try this because you will really like this one it does not like give white residue or anything like that Okay guys, so I laid all the sides down and I'm about to now take my head scarf and lay it down. Then I'm gonna come back on the camera with everything cut and then I'm gonna start the baby hair process and you know, the styling process of this hair. Yeah! I love the color of this hair. I like colors, so I'm excited, but yeah, I'll be back, okay? okay? So I'm about to start the baby hair process. Um, I've already started like taking some hair out. So I'm about to take some hair out and then I'm gonna just, you know, start cutting. I know if you are not new to my channel, this is my holy grail when it comes to laying baby hairs. I don't use nothing else. I don't like using mousse. Mousse just does not work for me. It just, I don't know, mousse just, I don't know. It just, it sometimes lift the lace. This right here does not lift the lace. And I know people are like, well, not to, don't use it because it will give you crusty edges. Best advice that I will have for people who are like scared that your edges will come out crusty is to just, when your whole hair is done, just take a raft tail comb and just comb out the edges. And the beauty about it is, it's not gonna lose the, the shape or nothing. It's just gonna look fluffy. So for my people who are scared that your, your edges will start looking crusty and stuff, that's all you need to do. Me, I don't really care. I can't cap. I don't care about stuff like that, so. Yeah, they're baby hairs. I I like, I low-key like my baby hairs to look. Well, I have my I have my moments. I have some times where I like my baby hairs to look crispy, and then I have times where I like my baby hairs to look fluffy. So it's really your preference. I like to take my got to be and also put it on the real, on the hair as well. Lately, I have not been overdoing it with the baby hairs. Lately, I've been just keeping it very basic, very simple. Um, I just like to do the 
the two baby hairs on, on each side and go about my business. I'm not really wanting to be, you know, trying to overdo it. But I'm not going to lie. Sometimes I do overdo my baby hairs, but I like it. And I have some people telling me that they like the way I do my baby hairs. And I got so happy because, y'all, I really have came a long way with baby hairs. Like, for real, for real. Like, I used to suck ass. And, I, and sometimes I still feel like I do. But, shit, I be trying, Sha. I came a long way. People who do like my baby hairs, thank you so much. And for the people who don't like it, I can understand why you don't like it. I feel like... So I feel like I have a long way to go with baby hairs, but you know, I can understand if you don't like my baby hairs, but for the people who like it, period. You bitches weak as you serious. And then I'm gonna do the same thing to this side. Yeah. So what I do is I just take this much amount, I cut into it like that then I take my tweezer I tweeze it you want to make sure that your your baby hairs is as tweezed as possible so just tweeze it down tweeze it down Like, you want to see space in between your baby hairs. Like, a lot of space. Like, like this, kind of. Oh, uh, is it me? Or was I, like, was I, like, the only one? Or, like, did y'all not know that it wasn't called a rat tail comb? That this shit is actually called a raft. Like, R-A-F-T. Tail comb. Like, bitch, I found that out the other day, and I was shook it. Like, I was dead ass shook it. Because my whole life, I've been calling it a rat tail comb. Because, bitch, I thought it was a rat with a tail. So, yeah, guys. So, for anybody that's wondering, it is definitely called a rat tail comb. Like, guys, I was so shocked. So right now, y'all, what I'm doing is what I told you guys before. I'm just taking um, got to be and I'm just like pushing it inside the hair. And it really just gives off a sleek look. And it also just gives off like a, a flatter look. And it also gives off a look that it's coming straight from the scalp, like an illusion that is coming straight from the scalp. So that's like one of the most things that I like to do and then considering the fact that I am doing a half up half down type of look I do want the hair to be very 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 and just very sleek like very very sleek I'm just playing around with it and yeah <sighs> just playing around with the hair and yeah I'll be back I'm about to go to the restroom and see if I like it I don't know it's something about me looking at that restroom mirror that lets me know yeah girl this is cute so I'll be back I'm about to play more with it and then I'm gonna close this video out but this hair is so pretty so guys this is the ending of this video this hair this is the ending result i just decided to put water in it the only thing that is in this hair is water no mousse no nothing so that should let you know that the curls are very beautiful now if you do want to lock in these curls the best thing to do is put mousse and gel and spray it with got to be or you can spray it with this um wonder lace bond from ebon 
and that would keep this hair like this all day but if you just put water in this hair throughout the day it might puff up a little bit but i'm not going anywhere special so yeah i just decided to put some water in it i really like it um i'm not gonna lie to you the lace was a little a little hard to melt i can't even cap like the lace was a little hard to melt so if you're a beginner <laughs> you are really gonna need to watch some videos so you can know how to melt this lace it's not one of the thin laces it's a very thick lace so i had problems with melting it even right here up here you can kind of see it's still kind of lifting but hey hey i tried sha i love you guys so much if you are new to the channel go ahead and check out the other videos and subscribe if you want to i will see you guys in the next one bye guys